shopping carts have been disappearing for months at the Walmart on Fashion Plaza in East Bakersfield. Some customers say they have been forced to buy fewer items as a result. 17's Robert Hagan reports. Here at the busy intersection of Mallview Road and Fashion Place is a big problem for hundreds of customers forcing them to adapt. And if you've been to the East Bakersfield Walmart, you already know about the shopping cart shortage. It's annoying when you come shopping and you, you walk into the store and there's no carts anywhere. And then you got to walk back out. You got to go search in the parking lot for the carts. And then usually when you grab one, they're either broken, the wheels missing, uh, chip in the tire and it bounces on rattles all over the place. And it's just annoying. I mean, I wish there was something, but people would do something about it. Former Garces Memorial High School track and field head coach Jesse Pena says he keeps coming to the East Bakersfield Walmart because he doesn't want to make a major commute to shop for the essentials. Well, there's not very many stores on the northeast side of town. It seems like all they do is build on the other side of town and we don't have much here. Walmart at Fashion Plaza received two shipments of 500 carts per order since April, according to employees. One worker says they're already down 100 carts since the last shipment in June. They've been scarce. I see the guys trying to uh, hustle them in for the customers, but what I see more of is a lot of people, vegans and homeless people have more carts than the shoppers. Cindy Corona says she's been forced to adapt to the shopping cart shortage by buying less. And now she has to bring her husband to help carry the items. You have to plan out your day what you're going to buy and make sure you get it and make sure you get back before your car gets vandalized. According to the Bakersfield Municipal Code that went into effect August 2022, removing shopping carts from business premises is prohibited if the cart has a sign that identifies it as belonging to the business. You could be charged with a misdemeanor and pay a $500 fine and spend six months in jail. While Walmart scrambles to buy even more carts and the customers continue to adapt, the best advice you can get is to probably grab a cart on your way in as the shopping cart shortage continues. In East Bakersfield, Rob Hagan, 17 News.